Hi, in this session, we'll see table extraction in UiPath. Table extraction is a technique of extracting data from a structured data source, and the output will be a data table. If you are using modern experience and UI automation package with version 2020.10 or above, you can see table extraction recorder on the ribbon of your UiPath Studio. So, this is a multiple pages tabular data, which I want to extract as a data table and then store in an Excel file. But before using table extraction recorder, I would like to mention an important note over here. According to your UI automation package version, your table extraction wizard will differ. If you are using UI automation package version 2020.10 to 22.4, you will see this table extraction wizard. Else, with version 22.10 or above, you will see this wizard when you click on table extraction recorder. So follow the steps according to your UI automation package version in UiPath. Now let's go to UiPath and start our extraction process. Click on table extraction. This will show you table extraction widget. Click on add new column or add data according to your table extraction widget type. Select any random cell from the data source. Now my table extraction widget or recorder is able to identify that this cell belongs to a table. It is showing me a pop-up saying, would you like to extract all the columns from the table? I will press yes as I want to extract all the columns. Now if your data belongs to multiple pages like this, you can click on next button or toggle multiple pages button to yes and indicate the next button or forwarding arrow on your data source. So this is the forwarding button. Now I'm done with all the steps. I can click on save and close or save icon on your table extraction widget. In your property panel, you can see the output of table extraction data is data table. From here, the steps are common. Now I want to store this data table in an Excel file. So I'll go to activity panel. Over here, you can search for right range activity. I'll drag this one and drop it over here. This activity requires three information. The first one, where you want to store your data means you have to provide an Excel file path over here, the full path. So I want to store my Excel file at this location. So I'll copy this location and paste it over here with the Excel file name. So I want my robot to create an Excel file called extractdata.xlsx. Now sheet name, I can give a sheet name called data Third information will be the data table which you want to paste. So my data table name is extract data table. If you want to store the headers also, you can click on add header. And now we can go to our design ribbon and run the process. Now you can see it is iterating through each page and extracting the information from there.
Now the process has been done. I can go to the destination and see that token Excel file has been created. I can open this Excel file and verify my data. So over here you can see it has extracted all the information the last page. Thank you for being here. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.